Hey guys, we're all Terrace. And this is Black is the new AP style. All right, you guys, new record. Yeah. Come oh, on. Yeah. What's going on? You guys just released it. Tell me everything that's happened since the release. Well, well it sucks. <laughs> what? God. No. It's been awesome. It's, it's been, been fun. Really we've cool. been touring a lot. Um, we've been really focused on just kind of being out on the road a lot as much as possible. Right. It's kind of been nonstop since like last yeah. December. So yeah. we're going on like eight or nine months now. So uh, yeah, we're Except almost for almost around for you know the next one. So very one. true. So has there been something that you guys have learned in this last eight months about touring that you didn't know before? Oh, a whole lot. A whole lot. <laughs> what are the secrets? Um, Divulge. Yeah, a lot of it. baby wipes. Oh, yeah. Mm. That's important. Sink showers. <laughs> baby wipes. Um, <laughs> Planet Fitness Black Card. Yeah, Planet, Planet Fitness Black, black Card. Oh, you don't hear that too often. Yeah, so with a black card, you get to bring a friend. So you only need two. And then essentially, you can like shower wherever you want. Well, for a four piece, it's perfect because we only have two. And then like... You know, we can go in. Show. And also, if we want to work out, we can too. And there's also like hydro massages, so that's pretty, you know, nice. But you guys are getting yeah. spoiled on this. Tour. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. But you know, it's it's Planet <laughs> Fitness black cards. They're really All right. nice. If you find a case yeah. of water, like ever in general, you take, take it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, lots of water. Or beer. Yeah. But you're yeah, not gonna find a case of beer. Yeah, you never no. find a case of beer. Yeah. That's yeah. much yeah. harder to find, oh, I think. Yeah. 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 Always find water. Water site. <laughs> so tell me about the recording process for you guys. Was there something that you learned this time around that you didn't know previously or a challenging moment in the studio? You know, I wouldn't say there was much challenge to it. I, I think with grief, well, okay, there was, a, there was one challenge, I think, for grief, um, and that was probably the vocals. Um, we didn't have a ton of time in preparation to do them, so I did a lot of last minute kind of pulling everything together. Um, and I would have liked to go back and like redo some things. Like okay. uh, I like I like to revisit things. Um, mm -hmm. I love the way a lot of the stuff came out, but it's it's always like, man, it would have been cool if I'd have done this. It's and like the perfectionist. Yeah, yeah, Absolutely. exactly. You know, you're never 100 percent happy with with what you create, but you are proud of what you've done. So you know, there's always what we could have done better, and and that's why we talk about it. So the next time, you know, we we do it. Exactly, so, exactly. Yeah. So the tour you guys are on right now, crazy lineup. You guys are all, you know, very close. Close, I'm sure on this tour around. Oh, so yeah. has there been something inspirational that the other bands have taught you guys or anything? Yeah, I mean, Man, they're learning from us. <laughs> what? Yeah. What are you teaching just, just, them? Just credit. Yeah. <laughs> just credit all these know. bands. Yeah. Sorry, everyone. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, everyone's super nice and everyone's yeah. like, it's like one big family just on the road together. Yeah. So we've, it, It's been a real good time. I really like to get to, get to uh, talk tech with all the guitarists, like what kind of tubes they're using. And, yeah. Uh, yeah. Fun they taught me that dreams come true. Because I was listening to Alessandra since I was like 13 years old. Like I cried the first night being on the same tour as them. That's so <laughs> sweet. Yeah. So dream come true moment then. Sean told me he's my friend, but like I cried about it. You can't go back from that, it's permanent <laughs> he, now, he's he your friend only, forever. He only told him yeah, that, he's not really. Oh. So, so, yeah. so, so they didn't like switch phone numbers or anything? Yeah, no, no. Not. Never mind. Definitely not. Yikes. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, I really it's been cool though, it's been cool. I think everybody's kind of had their own niche and we've all fallen awesome. into like where we're, you know, what we're doing and been a lot of fun. It's been absolutely, a lot of fun. Absolutely, absolutely. Getting to know everybody because we're all from different parts of the world. Right, cool. you guys are all from across the country, yeah. so it's exciting to get together and do this. Heck yeah. Oh yeah. So has there been like a most memorable moment from this tour? You know, I think for us it probably has to be after our show. Uh, well, there's oh man, a couple. <laughs> so like yeah, show wise, show wise, <laughs> we had like a super fun time in New York. Yeah. Um, it's Webster, and it's like the closing weekend for the for the, right. their yeah. renovation. Yeah, so Charlotte was there. It was, 303 was there. Every Black venue wow. in Webster was sold out that right. night. So it was wild. No matter where you went, there was just booming music, and it was super spiritual. It was really fun. Nice. Um, but outside of like shows, I think we had a really fun time in like Easton, just like hanging out with all the bands. We just like. Got some drinks, hung out. It was, it was a good time. So that was kind of like a yeah. fun off the there, there clock was, kind of deal, you know. There yeah. was like a, a restaurant that was connected to the venue in Easton, and like during the day, it just seemed like this tiny little like dive restaurant thing. And we our catering was in there, but like I can't. I went in that room like after the show, and there was like 900 people. And yeah. like the small it, it was ridiculous. It was rid and all the bands were crazy there. Club also. People were dancing like on the table. It was a DJ. Like, yeah. At crumble. one point, there were people dancing on the bar. It was yeah. absurd. We made a dance move. It's called the crump. Yeah. It's yeah. pretty rocky. Are you gonna teach it? <laughs> you have to be holding a drink right here. Oh, okay. That makes more sense now. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So that's signature dance move now. Anywhere you go, right? Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. So, 
It, it, works, like, it works for most. We're anything. extremely embarrassing, so. <laughs> uh, no, I'm probably, probably already, already caught on. That. If there was anybody yeah. interested in talking to us, they'd walk up and they'd be like, <laughs> <laughs> "Never <laughs> mind, I don't need a picture right, with this yeah, band." Yeah, Sorry. Like, like, that band played earlier. All right. Never <laughs> mind, something's wrong with them. They look right. questionable. Right. Well, thank you guys so much for chatting. We'll catch you guys next time. Oh, bye.